Naruto, God Level System Author, Blue Water God, Chapter 106, After the Three Generations of Thunder Shadows Listening to Rixi Angchen's light words, everyone felt a chill in their hearts, and the smart people chose to remain silent. I object, you Rixi Angchen openly. Don't say more, you belong to the Shimura family. I won't ask you the name of this dragon, now you are also a member of the martyrs. Rixi Angchen waved his hand to interrupt his nonsense. Anyone else object? Rixi Angchen stood up and glanced at the camp, facing Rixi Angchen's eyes. Everyone bowed their heads. At this time, they understood that whoever stood up would become a martyr. Who is willing to be a martyr? It seems that no one has objected, then you two dead people should rest in peace. Instantly pulled out the ninja sword of a ninja next to him, and then without waiting for the two of them to say anything, two heads rose into the sky, blood spurting more than. This is our Konoa martyr and must be buried properly. Rixi Anchen said with a smile on the corner of his mouth. Looking at Rixi Anchen's smile, everyone's heart was extremely cold and they swore that they would never provoke Rixi Angchen. This person was too cruel. They don't want to carry the title of martyr on their backs. After turning around, the coldness on Rixi Angchen's face disappeared. With a gentle smile on his face, he reached out and stroked Xi Aonan's head and asked, Xi Aonan is not afraid. Xi Aonan shook her head gently. She had seen too many dead people. In the land of rain, she could see dead people almost every day. Those who starved to death, committed suicide, or were killed. What kind of dead people have never seen before? and would not be frightened by such a scene. Rixi Anchen also understands this, so he created the scene in front of Xi Aonan, of course, to exercise Xi Aonan. Although Rixi Anchen will protect Xi Aonan, she cannot let Xi Aonan become a vase. Rixi Anchen glanced at everyone, and didn't care what they were thinking. He pulled Xi Aonan out of the main tent, leaving behind the silent members of the major families. Yuakai Huya has now decided that he will never go to hike Xi Anchen to find excitement. This kind of big devil can't be provoked without provoking it. If Saruto Bihazan is a more docile rabbit, Danzo is a sinister and cunning fox, and hike Xi Anchen is a fierce liger. In the eyes of these patriarchs, Rick Xi Anchen's move was killing chickens and terrifying monkeys, warning them to stay safe. If Rick Xi Anchen knew what they were thinking, he would definitely slap them in the face killing chickens and terrifying monkeys, but Sarutobi's words made Rixi Anchen unhappy, and then Rixi Anchen slaughtered them. But what Hixi Anchen did did frighten them. Even the Sarutobi and Shimura clans dared to kill them. They didn't leave any sympathy to the three generations of Hokage. Hixi Anchen dared to do something like betraying the village. What else did he dare not? In the next battle, because of the serious injury of the three generations of Reikage, he is still in a coma, and the atmosphere of Yunren has not been very good, and Hixi Anchen would not miss this opportunity and sent Sarutobi and Shimura clan to constantly harass Yanren, and small-scale conflicts continued. However, in a large-scale conflict, because the three generations of Reikage are still in a coma, they dare not fight with Konoa, and try their best to avoid fighting with Konoa. The battlefield with Yanren is in a stalemate, but the stalemate is a stalemate. Anyway, Rixi Anchen doesn't care. If you have nothing to do, use the space pupil technique and go to the rain country battlefield to find Tsunade and the others to play. It is definitely the most leisurely one on the battlefield. Rixi Anchen didn't take action, which made Yun Ren relieved, otherwise they really didn't know what to do. This stalemate lasted for more than a month. The three generations of Reikage also recovered from their injuries during this month, but they did not dare to rashly fight. No wonder the old fox Oyegi was so kind and gave us supplies. Now it seems that he wants us to withstand the pressure of Rixi Anchen. The third generation of Reikage was furious. Now their Yunren situation is very embarrassing. It is obviously impossible to attack, because they can't beat the opponent. It is impossible to retreat, not to mention that the three generations of Reikage are not reconciled. Even if they are willing to retreat, they cannot retreat. Otherwise, maybe it is not that they invaded the country of fire, but Konoa invaded their country of thunder. Father, what should we do now? It's a pity that Tutai's assistant has already. Otherwise, he can definitely give us a good idea. Alas, exit the country of fire first, and confront them in the country of Dan. Three generations of Reikage said with a sigh, Father, why don't you just give up the fertile land that you captured? AI was very unwilling. The front line is too long, which is not conducive to replenishment. If Konoa cuts off our material route, we will be trapped here. The three generations of Reikage didn't want to give back the land they captured. Even if they couldn't get the land, they could trade with the land of fire after the war and exchange it for a lot of money. But the battle line was stretched too long, and the opponent still had a powerful ninja like Rixi Anchen. If Rixi Anchen cut off their supplies, they might have to choose to lose the battle and surrender. Everything must consider the pros and cons. Don't be blinded by the immediate interests. Forcibly defend these interests, and in the end, you will get nothing. The third generation of Raking said to AI Education. In the next few days, Yun Ren started a large scale movement, and Konoa watched nervously, thinking that Yun Ren was going to fight them. But unexpectedly, Yun Ren actually retreated 
making the Kono a ninja who had already rolled up his sleeves bewildered. Yan Ren retreated. Do they want to withdraw from this ninja war? No, Yan Ren's ambition is not small, and he will never quit so easily. Yunin's battle line is too long, and it has entered our country of fire. The supple Lee side should be affected, and it is impossible to quickly defeat our Yunin. Now retreating is the best choice. Nara Patriarch analyzed. There is no need to discuss so much. They retreat. We will attack. Rick Xianchen said lightly. Under the command of Hike Xianchen, Konoa's ninjas kept harassing Yan Ren, making Yan Ren very annoying. From time to time, several large scale storms came, causing Yan Ren to lose a little bit. Three generations of Reikage. This is not the way to go. As soon as we counterattack, they will run away, and as soon as we retreat, they will stick to it like brown candy. What should we do? A quasi Yingyui report from Yan Ren village reported. I'll stay behind. After thinking for a long time, the three generations of Reikage said. No, how can the third 2.6th generation of Reikage stay behind? If you have something to do, what will we do in Yanren village? You have to think about Yanren village. I've made up my mind, I don't need to persuade. The third generation of Liying's head was very firm, and he didn't listen to the advice at all. Father, I'll stay with you. Whoever wants you to stay, hurry up and leave. You will only get in the way. The third generation of Reikage scolded his son. Under the toughness of the three generations of Reikage, AI still left, and even the three generations of Reikage did not leave a single person at all, leaving the queen alone. As a shadow of the post-broken genre, how can you stop the three generations of Reikage's hearts if you don't come to the post-broken once? Even when Rixi Angchen received the news, he was very stunned, wondering if this third generation Reikage was filled with paste. As a spiritual symbol in the village, he actually chose to cut off the post, and I have to say that the three generations of Reikage have a wonderful brain circuit. Chapter 107 Captive 3 Reikage Three generations of Reikage, I didn't expect you to be so afraid of death. Looking at the three generations of Reikage standing in front of the Konoa army like a mountain, Rixianchen came over. Since I have become the shadow of the village, I naturally have to take responsibility and protect everyone in the village. This is my responsibility. The third generation of Reikage sounded like a thunderous voice. Rixianchen shook his head and said, You know your worth. As long as you fall into my hands and become a prisoner, you young Ren village can be handled by me. I will never become a prisoner, three generations of Reikage said confidently. Although your choice is very brainless, I still give you great respect and capture the three generations of Reikage for me. Rixianchen shrugged and shouted. The ninja who had surrounded the three generations of Reikage, quickly started, ninjutsu, shuriken, and detonating charms, and threw them towards the three generations of Reikage. The third generation of Reikage turned on the Dun Chakra mode did not dodge at all, and resisted the attack with one punch and killed several people of the Sarutobi clan. That's right. The people who were sent by Haik Xianchen this time were the Sarutobi clan and the Shimura clan. The two clans numbered quite a lot, and the total number of them had already exceeded 1000. But in the face of a beast like the third Reikage, it is not enough to watch. With one punch and one kick, several ninjas died in the hands of the third Reikage. In just a few minutes, Dozens of corpses were already lying at the feet of the third Reikage. The Sarutobi family and the Shimura family are now afraid, and some people even want to retreat. Whoever dares to step back will kill Wash. Rixianchen's cold and ruthless voice came. Rixianchen, you are going too far. You just let us die. What grudges do our two families have with you? You should treat us like this. Looking at the few clansmen who fell down again, the new chief of the Sarutobi clan was angry, and looked at Rixianchen with hatred. As a clan of Hokage Sama, I don't want to contribute to Konoa but instead slander the coach with nonsense. What's the crime? Hayuga Tatsu asked with a smile on the corner of his mouth, facing Yuukai Hayu next to him. This, this. Yuukai who didn't know what to say, he didn't want to offend the Sarutobi clan. All of this is for the village. Your death is not worthless. Without you, three generations of Reikage were exhausted. How to capture him? As the clansmen of the two leaders of Konoa, shouldn't your two clans take the lead? Rixianchen's words left them speechless. Although they knew that Rixianchen wanted them to die, they couldn't refute Trixi Angchen, which was very uncomfortable. The three generations of Reikage laughed. I didn't expect Konoa to have such a big contradiction. This is a good thing for Yunren. So the three generations of Reikage killed more effectively, and the ninjas of the Sarutobi and Shimura families were desperate. Their attacks could not break the defense of the three generations of Reikage, and they were chased and killed by the three generations of Reikage. Rixi Angchen, you really want us to be wiped out? How will you explain it to Lord Hokage? Do I need to explain? You all died for Konoa, and the three generations of Hokage should feel relieved. Rixianchen did this for a reason. The Kaienzu clan was attacked in the rear a few days ago, and only less than ten people survived. The most important thing is that they don't know who attacked, not even the corpse. Tsunade, who learned the news, was very sad, and it was only after the constant comfort of Rixianchen for the past few days that he recovered. According to Rixianchen's guess, 
Perhaps it was Danzo who attacked the Kaienzu clan, although it was just a guess. As long as there was a guess, it was enough. Hirik Xianchen didn't need evidence to make Tsunade so sad. How could Hai Xianchen let Danzo let go, and the three generations of Hokage as accomplices? And now that the Sarutobi clan and the Shimura clan are under the jurisdiction of Hai Xianchen, Hai Xianchen didn't mind taking action against these two clans. Rik Xianchen assured that as long as there are two clansmen on the battlefield, no one will return to Konoha alive. After half an hour, the earth was dyed black and red, and the blood gathered on the ground into a small stream flowing slowly. Most of the ninjas of Sarutobi and Shimura's family have now been killed, but the three generations of Reikage are still alive and well, and they are not tired at all. I have to say that the third generation of Reikage is also a monster. The reason why Rixiangchen is so strong is because of the help of the system plug-in, and the third generation of Reikage is all on his own. Watching Sarutobi and the Shimura family die, some people on Konoa's side were happy and some were sad. But no one stood up. Looking at Rixiangchen's posture, he knew that the two families were going to be killed, and they would only be asking for trouble if they got involved. Rixi Angchen, you have to die, we fought against him. The Sarutobi and Shimura families actually put down the three generations of Reikage and rushed towards Hai Xi Angchen with blood red eyes. But Kikai and Yuyu, countless golden light bullets fell, and the two big families Sarutobi and Shimura, accompanied by endless light bullets, completely came to an end. On the entire battlefield, as long as the ninjas from Sarutobi and Shimura were not alive, they were all beaten into sieves by light bullets. The members of the two families are left with the old, weak and sick in Konoa village, and the two big families of Konoa are completely lonely. At such a young age, he is cruel and ruthless, yet he is cold-blooded and ruthless against his own people. The third generation of Ryakage carried an endless chill in his heart. Rixiangchen's indifference made him feel chills in his heart. Even so, to his companions, how ruthless should he be to his enemies? You're wrong, I didn't take them as my own. Rixiangchen said flatly, It's your turn now but you can rest assured that it is still useful for you, and I will leave you a small life. Rixianchen instantly appeared in front of the three generations of Reikage, posing a soft boxing start. The pupils of the three generations of Reikage shrank. He was seriously injured by the soft fist last time. Naturally, he did not dare to underestimate him, and quickly stepped back. Although the third generation Reikage was indeed fast, it still couldn't compare to Rixianchen's shot speed. Soft boxing technique, 8 trigrams. 128 palms. The gossip formation enveloped the three generations of Reikage, and then, in the breath, the three generations of Reikage fell to their knees, spitting blood, unable to move. The third generation Reikage, who was the enemy of the tailed beast, knelt down in an instant. You should be glad that you are valuable, otherwise you would be a corpse now. Rixianchen looked down at the third Reikage, who was half kneeling on the ground and supporting his body. Have the ability to kill me. Three generations of Reikage roared. Kill you? Are you still worthwhile if you die? If you feed your corpse to a dog, the dog will think your flesh is too hard. Rixianchen smiled evilly. Seeing the evil smile on the corner of Rixianchen's mouth, the third generation of Reikage's body was cold. He thought that he would die, but he never thought that he would be captured in a single encounter. What do you want? The prisoner is not qualified to ask questions, so take it to me and take care of it. After Rixianchen finished speaking, he left. After Rixianchen left, everyone in the field looked at the mutilated corpses everywhere, and a flash of sadness flashed in their eyes. I didn't expect your soft boxing from Hayuga's family to be so powerful. Yeah, it's so easy to subdue the third Reikage. Ha ha, Patriarch Hayuga smiled bitterly. Is it because their Hayuga family's soft fists are powerful? It is clear that Rixianchen is powerful. If he were to fight, even if the three generations of Reikage stood still, he would not be able to block the opponent's acupuncture points. Suddenly, Patriarch Hayuga thought of a question, that is, Hayuga Chen obviously doesn't have a blank eye, but how to perform acupuncture? Patriarch Hayuga didn't pay attention before, but now I remember. After thinking about it for a long time, he had nothing to gain, so he could only keep this question in his heart. As for asking Rixi Angchen, he said that he wanted to live longer and he did not want to ask the cruel big devil. Chapter 108 Exchange Now Rixianchen is in the Konoa station, but he is scary, although he looks handsome, he looks a little cute because of the childishness on his face. But in the eyes of Konoa ninja, this is a demon in human skin, and he has no scruples in doing things. In front of thousands of ninjas from the major families of Konoa, he destroyed the ninjas of Sarutobi and Shimura families without any intention of concealing them. If you are teammates with this kind of person, you have to be careful of getting killed it will make people panic. Although Rixianchen saved Konoa's crisis, he did not receive any respect, only endless fear. Today's Rixianchen's reputation is even worse than that of the cold-blooded and ruthless Okaimaru. If it weren't for Rixianchen's strength being too strong, everyone would have shouted and beat him. Rixianchen also knows that his reputation is not very good, but Rixianchen doesn't care, whether it is a good name or a bad name, as long as he is famous, it will be remembered by others. 
It doesn't matter whether it will last forever or be stinky for thousands of years. Because the third generation of Ryukage was captured and became a prisoner, now Yanren village is in a state of panic and confusion on his face. Even the future fourth generation Ryukage AI was confused. He really wanted to take someone to bring his further back, but his reason told him that going there would only bring Yanren 460 into danger. Although he really wanted to save his father, he was also responsible for the rest of Yanren AI. Rixianchen brought three generations of Reikage Sama and was calling out outside, and he also humiliated Reikage Sama in public. A Chunin hurriedly came to AI's side and reported to him. Touch. AI smashed the table with his fist. Too deceiving. AI's fiery temper couldn't bear it any longer, and he went out to fight with someone. Rixianchen, if you were a man, let my father go. After AI came out, his eyes turned red when he saw the scene in front of him. I saw the three generation Reikage tied in front of the formation and a few ninjas were slapping their faces. Although the three-generation Reikage was rough and fleshy and would not be injured at all, it was too humiliating. Three generations of Reikage, a man of steel will, had the intention of death in his heart. If it wasn't for his body being out of control, he would have committed suicide long ago. What a humiliation to be slapped in the face in front of tens of thousands of ninjas. Ling is the face of Yunren village. Now that he is slapped in the face, it is like hitting the face of the entire Yunren village. If this is spread out, Yunren village will not be ashamed. And his three generations of Ryukage are definitely the most humiliating Ryukage in history. Even if he dies in the future, he will be poked in the spine. I have to say that Rixi Angchen's move is a bit heartbreaking. Rixi Angchen, why are you so despicable? AI growled. Despicable? That's right, I'm despicable. I just do anything to achieve my goals. What can you do to me? It's not just watching your father get slapped in the face. Rixi Angchen said shamelessly. AI's teeth were broken. This is not a description. But a real bite. AI, Yunren's compatriots, don't worry about me. If Rixianchen has any requests, he must not agree to him. Three generations of Ryukage roared. Noisy. Be your prisoner with peace of mind. Rixianchen used Yin and Yang to condense a black chakra stick, and then knocked him unconscious. Now we can talk about trading chips. Rixianchen said his real purpose. What deal? I didn't agree to deal with you. AI said with a cold face. If you say that, then the bargaining chip of the three generations of Ryukage will be worthless. It's better to chop it up and feed the dogs. It just happens to be a meal for the ninja dogs of the Inuzuka clan. It can be regarded as a waste. Rixianchen chuckled. Said, you dare. AI roared furiously. But looking at the smile on Rixianchen's face, AI's heart was cold, shocked and angry. To be able to humiliate his further like this, Rixianchen is definitely not a decent person. I am afraid this kind of thing can really be done. If you are a dutiful son, Redeem your father. If you don't care about your father, then it doesn't matter what conditions. AI's face was gloomy. Take eight tails and two tails in exchange. Rixianchen stated his main purpose. This is impossible. AI roared angrily, and they themselves thought that the tailed beasts were not enough. How can you hand over your own tailed beast? You also said that I was despicable. You don't look at yourself. You are ruthless and unjust. You don't even want your father. Do you want him to die early, and then take the throne yourself? Rixianchen mocked. Because of Rixianchen's remarks. The ninjas of Yanren village looked at AI in a wrong way. AI's face was as black as ink, and he hated Rixi Angchen even more in his heart. He not only threatened them with his father, but also put him on fire. I won't talk nonsense with you anymore. In ten days, if I don't see your eye and her way in ten days, you will never see your beloved three generations of Reikage. Rixi Angchen said coldly, then the people with Kono are left. Yanren's face was so ugly that he was dying. He clenched his fists and wanted to rush up to save the third Reikage. But he didn't dare to go forward. The person watching Konoa disappeared completely, and AI said with an ugly face, I ordered my cousin Balubai to come and bring Oi, who was sealed in an amber bottle. AI? Are you really going to hand over the eight tails and the two tails? What if you don't? Do you want to see my father killed by Rixianchen and then humiliated by his body? AI said furiously, he could no longer control his emotions. Time passed quickly, and nine days passed in the blink of an eye and the eight-tailed man's Yulibaru by, as well as the amber bottle that sealed the second tailed, all arrived. And AI also told Balubai about the current situation, Balubai didn't think much, and agreed to exchange back to the third generation of Reikage. This made AI feel relieved, but at the same time felt guilt towards Balubai. Oh? It's pretty fast. There's still a day left. Rixi Angchen, who was teaching Xionan, suddenly received a message. The letter said that they agreed to exchange the third generation Reikage which was not unexpected by Haixi Angchen. The third generation Reikage was the backbone of Yanren, and it was much more useful than the two tails and eight tails that could not be used normally. And the three generations of Reikage are also the face of Yanren village, and Chuking Yuli Yanren will exchange for the three generations of Reikage. After talking to Xiaonan, Rixi Angchen separated a shadow clone to protect Xiaonan. The shadow clone has the strength of the peak of shadow level, and it is easy to protect Xiaonan. After that, 
Hixiangchen didn't call Kono as ninja, and went to trade with the three generations of Ryukage and Yanren alone. How is it that Yanren didn't give up on you, Ryukage? Do you feel very relieved? Rixiangchen asked the third generation Ryukage. Humphrey, the third Ryukage, who was dragged by Rixiangchen, snorted coldly. After arriving at the trading location, Air had already taken Yanren's entire army and was ready to fight. Bring so many people here. Do you not believe my character? Hey Tilda you deserve our trust? Ai asked sarcastically. Rixianchen shrugged, not angry. Chapter 109 Two Tails and Eight Tails Three Ryukage is here, so what about your tail beast? Rixianchen threw the three Ryukage in front of him. Seeing this scene, Ai's heart boiled with anger. Nizai, who asked you to agree to his conditions, what did you agree to? Three generations of Ryukage roared, because when Rixianchen and Ai Dan exchanged chips before, the third generation of Ryukage was knocked unconscious by Rixi Yangchen with a black stick, and he did not know the specific content. Ai Wenyun lowered his head and said, on the condition that I use the eight tails and the two tails, I can exchange for my father. What? If it wasn't for the third generation of Ryukage being dissipated by Rixi Yangchen, he couldn't exert any strength at all, and he would have to jump up now. Eight tails and two tails are the lifeblood of their cloud ninja village, so they exchanged it like this. Although the object of the exchange is their own life, the three generations of Ryukage absolutely disagree. Get me out with Balubai. I need you to save me, you old man. I tell you, even if I die, I won't agree to this exchange. Rixianchen frowned, and then kicked him stunned. This old guy was so annoying. He was obviously a trader, and he even called out a few times. Rixianchen, what are you doing? Ai's heart was full of anger. Looking at Rixianchen's behavior, he simply doesn't see his further as a human being. Rixianchen really did not regard the three generations of Ryukage as a human being. In his eyes, the three generations of Ryukage were just goods for trading. It's not even a cargo, it can only be regarded as a bait, a bait to send your eye and her way to the door. Now in this situation, it is meaningless for Rixianchen to trade or not to trade. Anyway, Yao and Erao are already present, and it's a big deal to grab it directly. In other words, the current three generations of Ryukage have no use value. If it wasn't for Rixianchen being a bit moral, the three generations of Ryukage would be cut off now. You don't have to play with that broken jar. I know its capabilities. Throw it over here. Rixianchen looked at the amber bottle next to Ai and said lightly. In fact, Rixianchen is also unable to complain. He really can't see that this is a bottle. You can call it a jar or a bucket, but it is called the amber clean bottle for Mao. How does it look like a bottle? You let my father go first. Ai frowned slightly. He wanted to seal Rixianchen with the amber bottle, but now it seems impossible. Hixianchen pulled out the flowing blade Yu Oh Yu Oh and then put it on the neck of the third Ryukage. Do you want to try whether his neck is hard or my knife is sharp? Rixianchen said with a sneer. Ai's face was ugly. After hesitating for a while, he threw the amber bottle over. The corner of Rixianchen's mouth showed a smile, the armed color domineering wrapped around Liu Ren Yu Oh Yu Oh, and then he swung down with all his strength. A two-tailed giant cat came out of it and roared in the sky, venting the depression in his heart and the excitement of being liberated. You actually destroyed the amber bottle. Ai was very angry when she saw that the treasures in the village were destroyed and Erwai was released. Everyone retreat for me. Ai yelled at the ninja behind him. The tail beast is almost a disaster for ordinary ninjas. You stinky cat, calm down for me. Tensizen's ability to manipulate puppets instantly took down Erwai. Although Tensizen can't restrain the tail beast like Samsara and Sharanian. But controlling a weaker second tail is simply a breeze. Now Erwai is in front of Rixianchen, just like a well-behaved kitten, causing Yanren's eyes to pop out in the distance. Can't believe what they saw in front of them. Is this still the Erwai that makes them terrified and the troubled villages turned upside down? Controlling the tailed beast, when will the Hinata clan be able to control the tailed beast? Isn't it legendary that only Yokai has Shaker can control the tailed beast? Ai whispered doubtfully. However, no one explained to him that Rixianchen is now busy drawing the chakra of Erwai. Because he is very skilled, Rixianchen draws the tailed beast chakra very quickly. After drawing enough chakra, Rixianchen unlocks the control of Tensigan. Erwai gave a jolt, then dragged his body, which was half shorter than before, and thinned a circle, and flexibly ran into the distance. Now it just wants to quickly avoid Rixianchen. It was controlled by Rixianchen before, and it doesn't want to enjoy the feeling of being involuntarily. Seeing Erwai swiftly rushing into the distance, Rixianchen didn't stop him either. Anyway, Erwai is useless now, just run if he wants. Because Rixianchen did not block, and the speed of Erwai was one of the best among the tailed beasts. He soon disappeared into the distance. Ai looked at Erwai who escaped with an extremely ugly face. You let Erwai go by yourself, it has nothing to do with us. We will not help you get it back again. Ai said with a gloomy face. Rixianchen didn't speak, raised his hand to aim at Zulai Balubai, the eight-tailed man, and said softly, Come here for me. Vientian Tanyan. The powerful gravitational force erupted, and Burupi was sucked in instantly, 
and Air who was standing beside him couldn't react in time. Rixi Angjin. Do you want to be trustworthy? Ai barred and ran towards Rixi Angjin. You'd better go back to me. Rixi Angjin kicked the third Ai Kid lying on the ground, and the third Ai Kid hit Ai like a cannonball, sending Ai flying back. Hey I'm not a good person, but I can still talk about basic credit. Let's go with the three generations of Reikage. Hikesi Anchen stepped on Barubai and said with a chuckle. Yao, you can feel it. The other party is absorbing your chakra, don't you want to resist at all? Barubai talked to Yao in his heart. Eight Tails was silent for a while, feeling the chakra disappearing like running water, and he was really unwilling. The other party can capture the three generations of Reikage, even if I lend you my power, it is not an opponent. Yao, are you afraid? Barubai mocked. How could I be afraid? The eight-tailed cow ghost was very upset. Even if the nine-tailed came, it wouldn't be afraid. I'll lend you my power. Yao lent the chakra to Burubai. The eight-tailed chakra coat immediately appeared on Burubai's body, wrapping him, and Burubai felt that his power had increased greatly, as if he could blow up a mountain. Do you still want to resist? Rixi Anchen smiled. Drink. I won't accept my fate. I want to defeat you and avenge the three generations of Reikage. Burubai burst out with chakra and broke free from under Hikesi Anchen's feet. At this moment, there were six tails behind Burubai and the whole body was covered with black and red-tailed beast clothes, which had already entered the half-tailed beast transformation. Let your eye come out. This way, you can still fight against me. With the current you, it's far from enough. Rixi Anchen said floating in the air. Chapter 110 Tensegan Chakra Mode You don't need eight tails, I can defeat you now. Buru by Rod, and the huge octopus tail was drawn towards Hikesi Anchen. Rixi Anchen frowned, but he didn't expect this guy to be quite ignorant, so he avoided the octopus tail at will, and then used the speed of light to kick. The defensive tailed beast's coat was smashed with a bang, and the half tailed beast turned Burubai was kicked away, and was almost killed by Rixi Anchen's kick. Fortunately, the eight tails in his body protected him, otherwise, Rixi Anchen could kick through his body with one kick. Burubai, you are not his opponent, leave it to me, said the eight tails in Burubai's body. Yao didn't want Burupi to die, otherwise it would have to be buried with Burupi. Burubai hesitated for a moment, nodded and then handed over control of his body to Yanao, entering the form of a full-tailed beast. Yao is out, maybe we have a chance. Ai carried the three generations of Reikage on his back, and took Yan Ren to stand and watch from a distance. Eight-tailed? The tailed beast, second only to the nine-tailed, should also give you some respect. Let you see my strongest state. Rixi Anchen chuckled softly, and then shouted, Ten Simora Chakra Mode. The dark's blue chakra shrouded Rixi Anchen, making it impossible to see his face at all and there were twelve golden light floating around him. Rixi Anchen's Tensegan chakra pattern is different from Toto Otsutsuki's. As for who is stronger, there is no real comparison, and Rixi Anchen doesn't know either. However, Rixi Anchen can feel that he is a strong pervert now, and in Tensian chakra mode, Rixi Anchen is already six paths. The powerful chakra pressed the air, and the surrounding rocks cracked and cracked open. Sixth Tao level. How is that possible? Eight tails are obviously stunned. This Nima is still a fart. Although each tailed beast is very proud, it is not a fool, even if they are nine-tailed beasts together, it is not enough for six seconds. After stepping into the six paths, it is already a qualitative leap, and it can even be called the realm of God. Yahweh, are you ready? Rixi Anchen showed an evil smile on the corner of his mouth, but unfortunately it was shrouded in chakra, and no one could see it at all. Entering Tensegan chakra mode, Rixi Anchen can feel that his ability to extract chakra from a distance is stronger, and his pupil power is also greatly enhanced. Ninjutsu, Taijutsu, Illusion and Chakra have been improved by dozens of times in an all-round way, which is even more exaggerated than the Immortal Mode. Even Rixi Anchen didn't know that Tensegan's Chakra Mode had this effect. Rixi Anchen turned into a streamer and disappeared, and his movement speed was comparable to that of Glitter Fruit. He instantly appeared beside your eye, and then punched your eye. With a loud boom, Yao was punched to the seaside by Hayuga Tatsu from the border between the Land of Fields and the Land of Fire. This punch made Yao fly out of a country, and Yao's current condition is very bad and has been seriously injured to the point of collapse. The chakras on your eye's body began to overflow, and he looked like he was about to die, and half of his body had been beaten. Rixi Anchen also smacked his lips. It was the first time he used Tensegan chakra mode, but he didn't expect it to be so strong. He didn't even release his ultimate move. Just an ordinary punch and eight tails are going to kneel now. Released a green sphere and collected the eight-tailed chakra in the air, and then Rixi Anchen disappeared in an instant, crossing a country and appearing beside the dying eight-tailed. Rixi Anchen's punch just now is no longer weaker than Bei Mankai, and now Bo Ai is just struggling for a while, and it can be said that he is dead. Rixi Anchen naturally wants to take advantage of the eight-tailed breath now, and quickly draw the eight-tailed chakra. After Rixi Anchen finished drawing the eight-tailed chakra, the eight tails at this time were about to dissipate, not to return to Renjin Churiki's body, but to die. You are also a decent person, your eye. No, 
You're a decent beast, so I'll give you a decent way to die. The golden wheel is reborn. The golden quest jade flew into Rixie Ancient's hands, and a golden chakra lightsaber that penetrated the sky and the ground appeared. The lightsaber had pierced through the atmosphere and rushed out of the earth. Rixie Ancient held the lightsaber that had pierced the sky, and waved it at your eye. I don't know if it was a coincidence. The golden wheel reincarnated and brushed past the moon, cutting off a small piece of the moon. The Otsutsugi clan on the moon was already frightened. Boom. Under the attack of the golden wheel's reincarnation explosion, the eight tails have dissipated in the heaven and the earth, and the eight tails chakra in the heaven and the earth had slowly condensed. These are not important, the most important thing is the follow-up effect of the golden wheel reincarnation explosion, although the direction of Rixianchen's release is the sea. But the sea was also cut open, and Rixianchen could see the bottom of the sea, and even the golden wheel reincarnated and cut several kilometers deep on the bottom of the sea, and even Rixianchen couldn't see the great trench. The sea has already begun to boil, and the boundless tsunami has been set off. As long as the countries close to the sea area, such as the land of earth, the land of thunder, and the land of frost, are unlucky and baptized by the tsunami. The land of frost is even more unlucky, because it is blocked on the route of the golden wheel. The whole country is divided into two parts, and one part is reduced to an island. Hey, I don't know how many souls are going to die this time. It's a sin. Rixianchen looked at the tsunami that had already gone to the sky. Rixianchen roughly estimated that the tsunami must be at least a few hundred meters high. If this was shot all at once, it would be trivial to smash the island. Let's stop it. Rixianchen frowned. The silver wheel is reborn. The golden quest jade spun wildly, and the huge gravitational storm attracted the sea water, and then under the control of Rixianchen, it formed a huge water drill and flew towards the sky. Then it exploded in the sky and turned into a downpour. This should be regarded as artificial rain. This time, I have sent a second kindness. Rixianchen murmured. In fact, he could have ignored the tsunami, and it would not affect him anyway. However, Rixianchen discovered his conscience in 4.5 days and took action to solve the tsunami that could cause countless deaths. In fact, it would be easier to solve if Rixianchen would explode the stars, but Rixianchen would not. Originally, Rixianchen thought that he knew the principle of the terrestrial star and that he could control the gravitational force, so that he could use the terrestrial star. But the reality gave Rixianchen a slap in the face, no matter how he researched, he couldn't use the Earth Blast star. Later, Rixianchen was relieved. The Earth Blasting star was the core ability of Samsara I, just like the Golden Wheel Reincarnation Blast and Silver Reincarnation Blast of Tensigan, which were considered exclusive abilities. It is basically impossible to use it by knowing the principle, but Rixianchen is not lost. He still has a plug-in for the system. If he really wants it, he can go to the system mall to exchange it after the system upgrade is completed. If you like this audiobook, subscribe the channel for more videos like this. Leave some comment and let me know if you guys like this story, or you have a web novel you like and want to hear its audiobook. I will be happy to create them for you. Please like, share, and leave a comment on the video.